What's up, everybody? Welcome to another Game Fanatics Let's Play with me, Joel, and Mr. Ben. Hello. How's it going, Ben? I'm, uh, I got we're 30 playing... minutes, Joel. I can't talk. Yeah, that's right. So we are playing the 30-minute demo for Resident Evil 2 Remake. Um, this is Ben's most anticipated so game of 2019. For damn sure. You, you took a guess there, but you were right. I did. Yeah. So um, I'm really excited to kind of watch and and experience this game a little bit. Not really a, a genre I'm into, but I'm very excited to watch you play. Yeah, and uh, I have played the demo once on PC uh, a couple days ago, so I, I was going to download and play the demo again, <laughs> to be honest with you, on my PlayStation now. I gotta find that guy. And probably download it on my Xbox and play it there too. I've seen um, a lot of people talking about, like, like, why only 30 minutes? That's so weird. Because, okay, so here's the thing. I'll, I can I could pause it at any time and stop the timer. So I'm going to stop it to let you know a couple things. Cause there was okay. a demo for RE2 way back in the day that I think had a similar hook to it. Okay. And so it's a throwback to that. That's all it is. Um, there's so many cool throwbacks. I mean, obviously the whole game is a, is a remake, but we got the typewriter right here. We got the item box right here really cool oh a lot but you, of, you don't actually use the what? you don't use a typewriter like in the olden days right you i don't use... know you can't save in the demo and i've been oh, on media right. blackout since they showed the game once so uh i don't know if they if that's been enough all the ui is very similar to re7 and I so is this to... the is this the first one that leon shows up in this is the first appearance of leon yes okay He's looking very uh, Resident Evil 4-ish. Yeah, he looks very RE4. His voice actor, I'm not huge into. It's definitely not the same guy. Uh, granted, I think he's had like three or four voice actors anyway. Oh, okay. So, uh, it's just, he sounds funny. I don't know. Uh, but you can see cool little things here. There's a fuse missing. It's dark and spooky. Um, the UI is all from RE7. But there's tons of cool stuff like you couldn't look through windows obviously before. I mean, it's a stupid little thing, but the game is definitely meant to kind of have that slow feel of exploring. Like it still, game. it still has to pretty much be Resident Evil 2, just yeah. with some improvements and upgrades. And I wanted to, I was thinking about replaying Resident Evil 2, but I decided against it. But now I don't know, because it's this is so very different, obviously. I I've played it before. I just have never gotten super far into it. I, I played I it uh, once. Resident Evil ago. Three a lot, a lot. Like I, oh yeah, I didn't beat it, but I got pretty far into it. I liked Resident Evil Three. If they remake Resident Evil Three like this, I'm all in. Yeah, I mean this game just looks it like the graphics wise and everything. It looks really good. It looks incredible, and I I played it on PC, not Max on PC, but this looks pretty pretty damn close. Like you're not getting a a water down. This is on the pro, but you know it's, it's still. Yeah. I'm trying to rush through a little bit because I didn't beat it last time, and I want to get to the end. I want to get to the shotgun, cause damn is that shotgun insane. Oh, There's nice. This gif. I'll have to share you uh, this. GIF. Oh, I've seen it. I saw it on Twitter. Where he gets like shot in half. Yeah. <laughs> yes. And then the zombie yeah. starts crawling at you. Yeah. It's he just nuts. like looks down and he starts crawling at him. He's like, oh. It is absolutely crazy. Um, yeah. I'm also replaying Resident Evil 7. I love Resident Evil. I mean, I'll defend RE6. I'll defend the movies. I love Resident Evil. The only one I've ever fully played through was 5. And I actually really liked it. It's good, yeah. I, I think you yeah. should play this one. Jesus. But you should play 4. Uh, you should play 7 was really good. I could. I played a lot of 4. I don't remember if I beat it or not. Because I played it on PS3? PS2? PS2. It originally came out PS2. Wait, RE4? Well, it came, came out GameCube. Well, RE4. I'll get you out. It yeah. came out on PS2. It came out on GameCube, then PS2. It came out on everything, basically. Well, then, yeah. it, then it later came out on everything. I played a ton of it on PS2 when it first came out. And then I remember playing it on PS3 a lot. And then I got really into uh, Resident Evil 5. And then me and my friend co op the end of it because I couldn't. I could not press the button fast enough to get it to, punch to get him to not fall off and die at the end. Oh, I gotcha. Yeah. 
That part was annoying. I oh, haven't seen Jesus, any that's nasty. I know. This game is so gory. Oh. It's stunning. And, and and as I said, like, I've seen screenshots and a few random things. Uh, I, yeah, I've been trying so hard to not see anything about this game. It, it, it's oh, fucking incredible. <laughs> yeah, it looks really good. And gross. And All right, also, I'm not very good. It's funny, um, when you miss, Leon will be like, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> that's my, that's, that would be my reaction. I know. I'm not sure if there's something with this game, because it seems like they're modernizing some mechanics and changing things. Like, you can board up windows, like that window breaks and this guy falls through. Oh, really? Uh, yeah, you could board up windows and you find boards along the way. I think I aim better with this controller than the one I was using on PC. Wow. So I don't know if they die or not, because I've come back into rooms and had them run at me again. Oh, jeez. Um, they respawn. Yeah, I don't know. So, I know there's Jesus. another guy here. This is where I, I ran in here. You got jump scared. But anyway, there's a, a bunch of mechanics they, they seem to be kind of messing with. I do miss the RE4, RE5, like shoot them in the knee and then melee them. That doesn't seem to be here. Let's try it. Oh, can you melee? You can melee. Well, no, but like, see that she just falls over. You can't do like a suplex. Uh, I guess Leon didn't learn the suplex until later. Yeah, he didn't watch enough WWE. Oh my God. Please go away, man. Oh my gosh. It's brutal. Oh my god, the detail on them is insane. That's like, I, you get the shotgun and there's just flesh chunks off these zombies. It's unlike anything I've seen since maybe Doom, like the Doom remake, really? That's it? Yeah. Oh, fucking Doom. What a game. I can't wait for the next Doom. I can't wait for this game and it comes out in two weeks. And I am I know, I can't... losing my mind. Because this is basically everything I wanted from it. It's the perfect remake. Was it game of the show in uh, E3? For me, it is. I have no idea if it actually. Oh my God, he would have gotten. You're safe. But do you want me to skip these cutscenes? We can get more into the game. Thanks. Uh, up to you, man. I'm down. Leon Kennedy. I mean, it, I don't like hearing action. his voice. <laughs> his shitty Leon voice. I don't like. Ah. Uh... Yeah. But you like, could skip it. If you like. Well, I like this part where he offers his hand, his bloody hand. Yeah, let me just grab that. I'm sure you did what you could. Leon. Here, man. Let me give you a hand. Let me let me help Ooh. you up with my slippery blood paw. No. Ugh. Your zombie blood. Does anyone know what started this? Because you know he's gonna turn into a zombie. A Damn right. I don't think I can skip it actually. This... Yeah. Uh. Oh, I can. Let's just skip it. So he gives you the knife, and now you have the melee. That's what you were. Looking for, we have 21 minutes left. Yeah. And the cool thing, like, look, he has, to, he has to put the the knife away. <laughs> this game is not messing oh my around. Gosh. <laughs> All right, so now we need to go. Oh well, there's more stuff to explore here, which I never really did, because there's like there's like a couple things of ammo, I believe. And ammo is probably sparse, right? Yeah, especially if it's gonna start throwing guys at me, and I, they can come through doors. I don't really know. Like how many doors or like how far they're gonna follow you there was something on that statue all right we're just gonna go yeah it's a panel it's okay. like another puzzle yeah we're just gonna keep going he's like watching he's like what are you doing <laughs> i'm, I'm trying to not how I hurry through like because i normally i would play much slower yeah uh that's just how i play games it's slow and methodical so Oh, there's the herb right here. Is this gonna be a full sixty? What do you mean? Like full, like a full price game? Are you or is it kidding gonna... me? It's got two campaigns and it looks like this. Yeah, it should be eighty dollars to pay for this game. Oh, okay. I, I didn't know. Actually, I think I did because I got the deluxe deli uh, del delicious. I got delicious. the deluxe edition pre-ordered. You got the deluxe delicious. <laughs> I'm not even sure what it comes. I'm just like, I looked at my my thing for RE7. I have almost 40 hours played on it. Oh, wow. So it's worth Did you do, uh, you played through all the DLC? Uh-huh. Oh, okay. Yeah, I mean. 
I think for sure I'm gonna go for Kingdom Hearts, but oh my God. I would gladly watch you play this game. Good lord. Maybe I'll stream oh it. Oh my God. Oh Jesus. If you're there and we can get Nasty. Delphox every once in a while, I'll stream it. It won't be my first playthrough though. Oh! oh my God, I didn't see his head last time. Holy shit. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh. Yeah, his head's all floppy. Nice. He looks like a clicker. He does. But see, this is... I've missed the boards, but this is where you could board up a window. Oh, okay. Oh, you actually have to pick up the boards and go into, yeah, like, that I, crappy inventory screen. I forget screen. where they were um, last... But I found them last time, and I didn't this time. Oh. Sorry, we're closed. <laughs> the person at the window is like, oh. Yeah, no, they're, they'll, they're a zombie and they'll be coming for me in a minute. So if you look at the oh, map, gosh. it also tells you, get, get out of here, tutorial. Like, if you found everything in the room, and if you pick something up and drop it, it will, like, also highlight that, too. Which is a new, a new thing, especially with limited inventory. I wonder if we can make them fall. Don't crawl at me. Stop crawling. <laughs> oh, her legs, her leg chopped off. Jeez. Oh my god, this is my favorite game ever. Okay, did I already pick up the ammo there? Yeah, I did, okay. This is the map. Oh, it just played a noise off my stupid DualShock. I'm picking this game up on <laughs> Xbox One, uh, so I won't have to deal with that. Oh, for the, uh... For the X. Turn off the ether. For the X, for man. The X. True 4K. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Whoop, whoop, 4K. I want to see these people get chopped in half in 4K. Yeah, you want to see more detail than they already have. A lot of these doors are... Is mad at the vending machine? Yeah, I'm going to leave him alone. Okay. This is where you get the shotgun, though. It's like my Cheetos got stuck, man. Ah! I did die! Okay. 17 minutes. We're halfway through. So I found the weapons locker key. And we're gonna get go. the shotgun. Nice. The shoddy. One oh six. So here we go. Jesus. Some high tech oh, lockers. God. Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh my god. Oh. Okay. Oh. It's just like. The raisin people. Good lord. For those watching the Let's Play, I'm reacting a little delayed because I'm watching the stream. Yeah. So. <laughs> it's not that I'm having a hard time processing what's happening. It's. Oh, I found <laughs> a like roll a, of film. On like, like a five second delay. I love this shit. So now you can figure out how to find things in these lockers and whatever, right? But you're finding different items and if I leave them there... Oh my god. This is classic Resident Evil in such a cool way. And it's so modern and interesting to me. I love it. Love everything about it. So do you get a bigger like inventory bag later on? Like, I'm you sure you do. Backpack? You did in, uh, in RE7. Okay. Now that I have PSVR, I'm, like, tempted to look into getting RE7. It's supposed to be... I, they never did it on PC. They never put RE7 on PC. And I'm so disappointed. The VR? Or do you the mean VR, The VR, sorry. Oh. That's weird that they didn't, because maybe it's exclusive to... Yeah, they must have signed some Sony deal. for now. It's been two years. If they would have... You know, they would have done it by now. Yeah. Can imagine playing that in VR. And but it's like supposed to be incredible. Logan doesn't want to play the game because he played an hour of it in VR. It's like, nah, I'm good. <laughs> I'm like, I don't really blame you. I'm a, I'm really like. There is a zombie in this room, and I do not know where they are. Oh, there they are. I'm. I've been really happy with the, the little VR that I played. But I. It's pretty cool. It's just, it's, like Astrobot is just so good, and uh, I watched my wife play through the Moss, and that was really fun. And now I'm just like, there's a ton of like demos and stuff. Like I played like Starblood Arena, which they gave out for free a while ago on PS Plus. And Why are there two of them? Cool. 
Oh, there's two zombies? There they go. Oh, yeah. I'm they just came out of nowhere. Nope. There, Wait, shut his leg off. He's like trying to point at you. Go, 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 Leon, go! I don't know which way to go. Uh, safety deposit room. Oh, the west. Oh, office. he almost got you. Yeah, he did. Where'd the other guy go? Where did I need to go? I don't know where I go. I'm scared. Okay. Oh, here we, here we are. Here we are. Uh, find a way to get underground. Fuck. <gasps> Every door is locked. I don't remember where to go. Ah. Oh, those shadows. Kind of. Oh. Oh, I remember now. Freaked out for a second. Welcome, Leon. Look, he's got his little. I'm gonna try and fake this guy out. Oh, he's like new to the task force. Yeah, this is his first day or week or something. Oh yeah, I remember that part of the story. It's like his uh. He's so new, and then all this crazy shit's happening. Yeah, so this is a board. I combined those herbs. This is a board. Uh, I'm going to pick it up and get rid of the... Oh, I can't. So you could drop shit. Or can you drop shit? Is he rolling a joint? What is that? Discard. Oh, you can't recover them. All right, whatever. But that's a board on the ground that you could pick up. Um... I mean, but does it help to pick up the board? Like, even if you board up the windows, is you it going to keep them out? Or they maybe gonna... they won't come in. Uh, I was going to say, maybe it, like, just stops Oh, so I found a, the roll of film. I could develop the film. This is the film. We're going to keep going. Because <laughs> I've got 13 minutes. Time flies when you're an idiot. <laughs> All right. Put that there. How far, I mean, is it pretty much the full game, but only 30 minutes of it? No. Or is there just a demo and you get 30 minutes to play it through it? There is an end. Okay. Um, I was going to say, what if they, it was just a 30 minute trial of the whole game and then weird. people find out like a glitch kind of like with Yakuza? No. They, yeah. or they accidentally got the whole game. Whoops. Yeah, no, that, that's not the case here. That'd be cool. That's not the case. I'd be okay with it. Get the spooky statue out of here. Oh, I'm I might, the key. I might download the demo and try this out myself. You should. Like, but there's just so many rooms I'm skipping and shit everywhere. Oh, yeah, there's just stuff everywhere. Like, like, look at look at all the rooms that I'm oh, just. Oh, what was that? A monster. It was like one of those dog jumping uh, zombie board. guys. What was this? I don't have, I don't need gunpowder. But like, okay, I tried to pick up the gunpowder and now it's on the map. Anything I look at and see, look at and see. Oh, it, it tells you. Yeah, That's it good. tells you on the map. Yeah. So you can go back to it. That was kind of something that was introduced in Resident Evil Zero. You could, that was the first and only like traditional RE game where you could pick up and drop items wherever. And then you'd have to go back and get them if you, uh, oh. Oh, that's Zero, cool. was that the original remake of the first one? No, no, no. Zero is the, the one they made on GameCube that was new. Okay. Oh, look. See, I just got new inventory. Inventory space. You found a fanny pack. I know. I wonder if it's actually on him. I can't really see. Yeah. Leon, I'm sure it is. It's Marvin. Oh, this is in the... Are you okay, Marvin? It's coming through the speakers. I can hear it. That's because I raised. Oh my god, I just fell to the floor. Oh! This is where the demo stopped for me. I didn't get to this room. There's like seven of them in here. Go, oh, Leon, Jesus. go! Everyone knows Zambies can't climb ladders. No. They can't do pull ups, so. No, no upper body strength. No. Okay, I'm not sure where the demo ends, or if we're even... <laughs> where is... Oh, this is the room I came out of, okay. Is that a herb? No, that is a flower pot. <laughs> what if I could try and shoot him from up here? Where'd they go? What I'm also excited for, I'm a big fan of the mercenaries mode that's in a lot of these games. I think starting with three. What's up? Uh, what's mercenaries? Man? So it's effectively just a map from the game, 
and a bunch of items and weapons and just zombies and you do it until you die or you, the time runs out. Oh, kind of like kind of like a horde mode. Kind of, yeah. Look at me shoot the wall seven times. Look at big bloaty over here. Get out of my staircase. The big target you're missing there. I know. I know. This big fat head shooting the wall. Oh. All right, let's get the shotgun out. It's a lot of dress shirts people are wearing. Oh, that guy's alive! Oh, that guy's alive too! Stop it! Stop. Oh! <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, he bit you, and now you're gonna be a zombie. I don't think those rules apply here, but I'm not sure. Oh. Jesus. Ah, panicking! Panicking! <laughs> Uh, use the fucking key faster, Leon. I uh, see. I'm wondering if the safe room like this, they can't go into it, but they could go into every other room. Hmm. All right. This guy wanted me to come back here. I don't know. I don't know what happens. I don't know if this is the end or not. There you are. Come here. Take a look. It's in a book, reading Rebel. Yes. Oh, man, check out this video. Here she See, it's Claire. <laughs> check out my memes, bro. Yeah, name's Claire. <laughs> it's I like, why are you showing me your me. memes? We're dying. You can get to that courtyard. <laughs> Through the second floor. East side. Oh, is that Claire? Uh-huh. <laughs> I'm on it. Thanks, Lieutenant. Is that it? Oh, that was the end. Oh, I should have killed more people. But you can still go back and finish out the time. Sure, let's do that. Uh, so I was really close to beating it last time. I just fucked it up. Skip the... No, I don't want to go to a product page. Just buy the game. <laughs> buy me. So yeah, I still have uh, eight minutes. Let's do it. All right. Um, Speed run it. Let's see it. Speed it, yeah. Let's go, 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 go. But this, I, it really is remarkable how good of a job they've done. Like, it feels modern, and yet it feels exactly what the old Resident Evil style games like would be if they were made today. Modern, but pays respects. 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 To, uh, yeah. Respects. Pays respect to its its uh what is it origins. Yeah, but like to the point of where it's like if you had looked at Resident Evil 2 and said, "What would that be like if they remade it today?" This is it. It's not like they remade the game and like, "Oh yeah, that's Resident Evil 2." Like, no, this is the exact feeling of a Resident Evil game from back then. Just it's today now. <laughs> oh wow. Okay. And it's pretty yeah. pretty damn impressive. I love all these little items. I love how many locked doors there are. I'm all in. I know I'm going to play this game many times. If Resident Evil 7 is anything to go off of. Yeah. Well, 40 hours. I mean, that's... Yeah, that's, that's what, what the maybe DLC like a, It's like a 13-hour game, maybe? Normal? Yeah, maybe. Like the first time through, maybe. There, that's what I wanted, the ammo. Yeah, this game looks... It looks really fun. I might have to give the demo a try. You should definitely give it a try. We only got one shot. You Now you know what to do, which is shoot the guy in the head, not the wall. Yeah. yeah. That's, that's always a good idea. That's an important distinction to make. Yeah. I wonder where that Jesus. item I... And that door's Open locked. Up. Like, oh my gosh. Hurry. I just don't know the rules. Like, how do I know they're Open dead? How do I know they're not dead? I'll get you out. A lot of the Resident Evil games have like a... A thing where if you don't burn the bodies, they come back. Ow, that was a mistake. Oh, mistake! Well, it's cool. Like, you can, like, some of them might just get up and start coming after you. Like, you, you just walk by and think they're dead, and then they just pop up. Yeah, well, like in Resident Evil 1, if you don't burn the body, they'll come back later. Like, at a certain point later in the game, they'll just pop back up. 
if you don't burn the bodies. So you have to start like dicking around with your inventory. Do I have gunpowder or what is it? Fuel for your gas tank, and you'll start bringing the gas tank around with you everywhere. Jeez. The original Resident Evil is very difficult in that way. Look, yeah. I didn't kill anyone, so they're just all in <laughs> the doorway. Oh like the one guy just leaves. He just doesn't even care. Go out of here, man. You guys have fun. Oh. Oh, oh! As far as I can tell, I can't kick down doors and hit them. Can you kick them over? Oh, shit. No, I, I can't melee them at all. It's... Hmm. Oh, that's a cutscene I can skip? Does anyone know what started this? Uh. See if we could beat it twice, just run past everything. Yeah. <laughs> so with all the other items that are like laying around, would you have to basically go back and forth to like do stuff or collect things? Or? Yeah, that, I mean that's what the item boxes are for, and, and that's like that's why it's dangerous and why it's interesting because you can't carry everything with you, and you don't want to kill everything because you don't really have bullets to kill everything, but you have to go back and get certain things. Oh. So it, it is, that's the whole dynamic of it. I don't know why I even looked at him. What's the point? Oh, it's gonna fall, man! Ow, it did hurt me. Oh, oh he fell on you? That thing uh, clawed the walls right there. Or something clawed the walls. Wolverine. It's a liquor. It's you, Jackman. <laughs> you know, there are some points here where I can see the PC version looking better, but... Yeah. It's still pretty impressive. Certain textures, maybe the movement. And certain lighting, like far away lighting and whatever. Here's for the X version. Go, X, go. Go. Just gonna keep running. And like that door won't be marked as locked unless I go over to it and actually try and open it. And then it gets marked on the map. Oh. That's a good thing to know. Yeah, a lot of little, little funny details. There's another thing, like you used to be able to carry a sub weapon. And, uh, which was usually a knife or a stun or something. And, hold on, I need to find the gun, the gun store. Uh, but, like that, no one really wants to be, it was a one-time use item. You'd waste the item and then you'd have to go and, but it'd save you from being bitten, right? And now, you can do that, you can still stab the, the knife in them. But you won't be able to use the knife until you kill the enemy and take the knife from him. Oh, jeez. Which I, I love that. Just, like, take that mechanic and make it modern. How much time do we got? We got two minutes? Whoa! Oh, Booko. Oh, Alright, he just charged at me. Nice. See how like what we can do. We can chop off his arm or something. God damn it! There's arms dangling. Ah! <laughs> oh, there's arms dangling. All right. I'm just gonna run away. Run away. Run away. <laughs> man, the details like it's nuts. Oh man, I just wish the melee attacks were back. I want to be kicking people. I mean, it doesn't need to be kicking things like RE4, but something. But it's so cool, like, I didn't pick up that roll of film, and you can go develop the roll of film. So many little... Oh, nice, that's true, yeah. So many little things that you're going to have to, I mean, you're going to have to find most of this stuff, but... If you do what I'm doing now and just run past everything, you're going to get screwed. You're going to miss out on a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. Alright, we got a minute and a half. And this key, too. I missed... It. What is this room? <laughs> Did you play the uh, DLC that had ah! Leon in it? In uh, RB7? Did have what in it? Oh, Didn't it have Chris? a... Oh, it was Chris Redfield. Yeah, I did. And that was probably the best DLC. Ooh, more shotgun. 
It was definitely the best DLC. Let me rephrase that. Yeah. Oh yeah, you go up. How much time do I got? Do more four seconds. Go, 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 go! Go! I wanna shoot some fools. I did, that was the, a pretty good DLC. Overall, the all the DLC for seven was a little disappointing. Eh, DLC usually is. Yeah, but that's a lecture, yeah, for sure. What in the? But the base game was so good, it was kinda like, damn it. I mean, really, like, when you think about it, most DLC is kind of pointless, unless they're, like, like, for some games, it's necessary, and I get why they make it, because they want people to, like, keep the game, but if it's not good, or if it's just, like, for someone that, like, plays the game and then trades it in so they can get the next game, like, and then they miss out on all the DLC, it's kind of, like, That was the end of the demo. All right. That's the 30 minutes. Right in the back. Uh, yeah, that's a good That's a good game. Uh, Looks fun. 10 out of Can't 10 we? will download on Xbox. <laughs> I think it. I'm going to give it a shot, too. I want you to play. I almost wanted you to do this to see your experience. But I guess, you know, I have. Ooh, maybe, uh, I'll, maybe I'll do it later. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> All right, well, that'll uh, do it for us here at the Game Fanatics, and I uh, hope you enjoyed the demo. Um, ben is definitely extremely excited for this game, and it'll probably be his game of the year. If it's not my top five, if it's not my top three, it's going to mean something crazy happened this year. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Cool. Well, all right, guys, head over to uh, youtube.com slash the Game Fanatics, and uh, or if you're already there watching this, uh, make sure you subscribe and head over to thegamefanatics.com and read all the latest articles and reviews that we have there, and follow us on Twitter at the Game Fanatics. Until next time. Bye. Jabroni. Now.